Ciao. My, my name is Flavia Cristofolini and uh, I come from the north of Italy. In, uh, I live in Brescia, which is a town between Milan and Venice. I work with the uh, Catholic University of Milan and Brescia and uh, I'm here to present a research I have been conducted with uh, Professor Andrea Gaggioli and uh, Alice Chirico uh, on the topic of internationalization of higher studies as a form of uh, transformation and transformative learning. Now the concept of uh, the theory of transformative learning is particularly important in my work because I work both with students as a professor so I'm particularly interested in uh, making my teaching uh, work and more precisely to offer learning opportunities and a learning environment where they can truly experience a transformative learning and in the topic I'm teaching and also I'm also a psychologist and uh, a psychotherapist. So uh, I'm particularly interested in, uh, in, uh, in providing my patients, my clients, uh, a transformative experience, of course, into, uh, for, 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 uh, for growth of, a, of their true being. I don't really, <laughs> well, I mean, what I appreciate most in the theory is the uh, stress, first of all, on the difference between change and transformation. As a psychologist, I'm particularly interested in the psychological dimensions that are involved into the transformation. So, for example, in my research, I uh, explored the change in the psychological flexibility, for example, in the perspective-taking propensity, perspective-taking also confidence of the person, together with uh, the uh, ability to cope with new situations, so this new self being uh, born from the transformative experience. Well, what I hope to achieve is to keep on knowing the theory better and better and learning from uh, all the other people, people's experience, ex experiences I mean the people I met in this conference in particular and being able to put it into practice more and more and study it also from a researcher's point of view, especially as I was saying, uh, specifically in the psychological dimensions involved in the, into the transformation. Well, starting to be a part of the community means a, a lot to me. It makes a huge world of a difference because I feel I can relate and I can feel I'm part of a network. I'm not alone and uh, let's remember that transformative learning is relatively young in Italy uh, thanks to the uh, transformative learning association that ha was created uh, like 10 years ago, it's a very important association, we are just starting to introduce this important theory into academic and uh, uh, psychological practice and also coaching practice. So uh, for me it's, it means a lot to feel part of a community because I don't feel alone and that I'm ready to learn a lot from people who have already been in this field for, for more, longer time than, than I uh, than I am. <laughs> this is a very personal question. Um, well, professionally, uh, I can say that I experienced transformation when I took my second degree and uh, changed my professional figure into a more hybrid one. And I took my second degree in psychology and then I became a psychotherapist and a psychodiagnostician and a parent and teacher's counsellor consultant and um, so this was deeply transformative for me because I was not a young student any longer, I already had a family and a daughter and so that meant for me meant uh, transforming my perspective on myself and my career and from a personal point of view I believe that we all have had uh, transformative experiences. In my case I had 
the, the main transformative experience w was to have my daughter, Matilde, who really, it felt like having access to the second side, the second half of the world that I wouldn't have known if I hadn't had her. But also extreme negative in a way, experiences like I'm a cancer survival and also mm, losses mainly. So, and separations especially also. So, of course, we all have difficult experiences. Not all of them become transformative. I believe that in my case, they did. Uh, and I also believe in uh, post-traumatic growth. And uh, this is what I believe I lived in my personal life. Yes, what makes me excited about attending the conference is meeting, first of all, the we very welcoming atmosphere. That was really striking for me because I'm not used to being smiled at so often and also being able to access to important scholars that were very inf in a very informal way. We're ready to talk about their work and about their points of view on several topics. So that was really exciting for me. I've really felt part of a community and uh, I really appreciate it. That's very American for me. I'm a European. We don't have that warmth and attention to uh, welcoming, welcoming people coming from all different fields. So that was uh, uh, the, an experience that in itself has been transformative in a way. And uh, what I take away, I will take away the new network I've been able to build and uh, the new contacts. I hope, I intend to establish long-lasting, professional and uh, positive uh, contacts with these new people I met, new colleagues I met. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome.